Hey, my friend, Marian Santos here at Potential.com. Let's study the word. So, yung word today is gentle whisper. Yung Bible verse is 1 Kings 19 verse 12. After the earthquake come a fire, but the Lord was not in the fire. And after the fire came a gentle whisper. So, the one who wrote is Jesus Dina Pe Pequena. Pequena. So, yung story niya is uh, she had a confession. So, while in the confession, yung priest medyo terror, so, pinagalitan daw siya, no? So, nireplimand siya during the confession. So, confession. So, medyo nahiya siya, baka narinig ng mga tao sa labas, yung um, confession niya. So, sabi niya, kay God, are you angry with me just like this priest? So, natakot siya. Should I confess at another time? Baka yung timing niya mali, may inipang ulo ni Father. So, sabi niya, Elijah feared for his life. So, kasi diba yung sabi nga niya is, uh, he thought that God is mad with him. But, yung answer ni God did not came to an earthquake or a powerful earthquake or a basin fire, but in a gentle whisper, sabi yung sa ating Bible verse ng first kings. So, unable to receive comfort in confession, I went, she went to the Blessed Sacrament Chapel. I cried to God, Silently and in silence, he embraced me. So nothing is so strong so as gentleness. Nothing is so gentle as real strength. So he said, "Brad." So sometimes, di ba siguro we are so guilty or we are so bad that we felt uh, down. But sabi nga eh, uh, in the New Testament, God or Jesus is more understanding. Parang hindi na siya yung uh, so powerful God na we cannot. Uh, go or be near to but he is he puts himself like a man like a human being para maintindihan niya tayo kaya nga diba he came for us god bless us all thank you for watching please subscribe and like this video